and the board is in. Number three, the lady is a winner, is in. Hanover Hills Money, and the last one in, Jess Taff. They're at the post. And they're off. Eyes are really quick. Broke on top. Away second is the lady as a winner. And fading to the fence with Spark a winning shake. And eyes are really quick. Three parts of a length. From the far outside, Caraway's Jet Moon trying to close. But they're running out of ground. Eyes are really quick as a maiden no more. He wins it by a length and a quarter. The lady is a winner second. And Caraway's Jet Moon completes the triactor. Race to an official 236. The official winner of the second race was number two, Eyes Are Really Quick. Second was number three, The Lady Is a Winner. Third was number six, Caraway's Jet Moon. And fourth, number one, Spark a Winning Shake. Results of the second race are now official. The winner is number two, Isa Really Quick. Three-year-old Gray Gelding by Firefinder out of Isa Quick by Isa Special. Fold in Ontario by Gary and Marlene McNichol. Isa Really Quick is owned by the Big Dog Racing Stable, trained by Carol McIntyre, and ridden to victory by jockey Brian Bell. Isa Really Quick winning the distance with a time of 15.92 seconds, carrying a speed index of 83. Second number three, the lady is a winner. Third number six, Caraway's Jet Moon. And fourth is number one, Spark a winning shake. Now making the blanket presentation in the winner's circle is the executive director of Ontario Racing, Catherine Curry. 
making the presentation to the connections. That's Big Dog Racing Stable, Carol McIntyre and jo jockey Brian Bell aboard Eyes Are Really Quick. Here now are the total results of the second race from top to bottom in your programs. Number one, Sparka winning Shake finished fourth with a time of 16.27 seconds. Number two, Eyes Are Really Quick, the race winner with a time of 15.92 seconds. Number three, the lady is a winner with second with a time of 16.09 seconds. Number four, Jess Tough was sixth with a time of 16.51 seconds. Number five, Abby's Cash was fifth with a time of 16.39 seconds. Number six, Caraway's Jet Moon finished third with a time of 16.12 seconds. And number seven, Hanover Hills Money was seventh with a time of 16.66 seconds. Rechecking from top to bottom, order of finish in your program should read 412-6537. Those are the total results of the second race. In this upcoming third race, just the following overweights, boat number one, Rouge River Cartel, and number six, Coal Miner, carry one pound over. And boat number two, Situation Critical, and number five, I'll Be Gone Flying, will carry three pounds over. Note that race three is race A of the early pick four. Well, eyes are really quick, was very quick, and everybody who bet the favorite is pretty happy right now. We started off the pick five with the big favorite winning, the Gray Gelding, uh, bred by Gary and Marlene McNichol, and now owned by Carol and Dave McIntyre, the Big Dog Racing Stable. So Carol's gone back with the big guy. I'm here with Dave. Dave, tell us about uh, this gelding. Um, I know you guys are pretty high on him. He's a beautiful horse. Um, not very much luck last time, but his first two starts, second. So he's coming to hand quickly, isn't he? He is. Uh, we bought him uh, two years ago off of Gary McNichol. Um, Gary breeds some spectacular horses, and uh, I think he has seven or eight here today. Um, but we bought him and we bought another horse that's going to be rating, racing later on today in the Derby Final. Um, and both bred by Gary and uh, Marlene. And uh, we're very lucky to have him. Well, I know you guys do a very good job. And, uh, you know, we were talking earlier about how many uh, really nice horses you've raced this year. You've had a lot of seconds and thirds. So it's, it's great to finally get in the win column. It absolutely is. Uh, it's great to get in the win column. Oh, we have had we had good 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 year. I'm not complaining, but uh, yes, the wins are important. <laughs> well, congratulations and good luck in the Derby. What do you think uh, that how that race is going to shake down? You know what? It's a tough tough race, um, and we hope to fare well in it. Obviously, but uh, again, we'll see where we end up. Well, best of luck and thank you for joining us today, Dave. And we'll see you again soon. Thank you very much. Alive. Horse racing, very thrilling. Horse racing, the speed, beers one with the animal, nothing on earth, on the planet like it. <laughs>